it's really this whole art form that we're recognizing. An art form that s sadly doesn't reach enough people because these films don't make enough money. As a result, the big media companies don't own them uh, for the most part. That's a good thing because we have pioneering journalists like Eric and now Katie who pick up the mantle, make these beautiful and important works with people like Stephanie, the directors. These films can really educate, engage, and inspire people to react positively on today's important issues. Tonight, I'm pleased to honor Anne Lanzini, a dedicated and passionate teacher from Achievement First Brooklyn High School, who has implemented the course at such a high level. Unfortunately, she couldn't be here tonight to accept the award. However, I do have two React to Film students from KIPP NYC College Prep in attendance, to my right and left. <laughs> um, I really appreciate Katie Couric, Lori David, and the director, Stephanie Sotig, for being here tonight, for making this film, for challenging the status quo. I hope you'll come up and accept the award this year. <laughs> You know, this is only stage one of, of the work. We made this film as a tool for people like you, and we really need everyone's help, literally everyone, even those you, you know, of you that are taking our pictures, we're calling on you as well to go and see the film. A and tell five people about it, because change is possible, um, but people need to be informed. And as of right now, it's not a level playing field. So I implore all of you to let your voices be heard and to realize what a difference you can make. And now I'll let you hear from the lovely Katie Kirk. Thank you. Thanks, Stephanie. It's going to take much more than a 90-minute documentary to change people's personal habits and to change public policy in this country. And it's really our profound hope that people will learn something when they see this film, that they'll be educated and they'll have the information they need to make much more well-informed choices, not only when it comes to feeding their kids, but when it comes to pushing our legislators to, to just say no to big food and to do much more when it comes to marketing to uh, really our youngest and most innocent victims of sort of the food culture that currently exists today. So um, thank you so much. I really hope you all, as, as Stephanie said, will go see the film. Um, I hope that you'll get your children involved because just as I flushed my mom's cigarettes down the toilet with my brother when I was about eight or nine years old, I think that children, when they hear the fact that they are expected to live shorter lifespans than their parents, I hope they'll become irate enough that they'll want to get involved and they'll want to, you know, to perhaps teach their parents well. And uh, so we hope you'll spread the word. We hope you'll go see the film and support the film because it's important that it becomes a commercial success for it to change public policy and change attitudes. And, um, and again, we hope you'll, you'll tell everyone you know and that it will become a platform and a springboard for a really important conversation we all need to have about changing the way we, we eat today because, as I said, it has effect on global competition, it has an effect on military preparedness, uh, you know, whatever your political persuasion is, if you want this country to be strong, then we have to really push for some very significant changes. So thank you so much for this award, and here's Lori. This, I mean, how often, I've, listen, I worked on a really tough issue, global warming, okay? And the solutions to global warming require countries to cooperate and step forward and sacrifice. This problem is completely preventable. And the exciting thing about it is that the solution is in everyone's kitchen. And it's at the end of everyone's fork. So I think you're going to, first of all, you're going to find that even if you think you know a lot about food, you're going to learn things when you see this movie. I did, Katie did, Stephanie did. And people leave the theater knowing things they can change immediately to make a difference in the health of themselves and their family. So that's all I want to say. Thank you so much, Dennis and Coralie, and React to Film. Thank you.